the exclusive 4GT, new Mercedes A and B class models. Hello my dear viewers, 4GT without any doubt one of the most beautiful American sports car of our time. What is the American? Even on a global scale this car stands out other similar models. Today's hero of the review is not stands out for some super technical characteristic, but it is so fantastic that I couldn't pass by and not to tell you about this project. We are talking about the 4GT LM Edition, the third and final project sports car which is included in a special Heritage Edition series, under which models are produced giving tribute to the company's success in various sports competitions where participated 4GT. Latest edition dedicated to the most recent victory of American company in opposition with Ferrari. And I'm talking about the GM that Ford won in 2016 at Le Mans over Italian manufacturer. The GT LM edition features liquid silver carbon fiber bodywork with a choice of red or blue color shams. For sales, the front splitter, door seal, side seals, rear splitter and door mirrors can be finished in red or blue, as can the 20-inch wheels, lug nuts and brake calipers. This exclusive variant also benefits from a 3D-printed titanium dual exhaust as well. Inside, drivers can choose either red or black Alcantara driver's seat with a bony-colored passenger seat. And so, that is there were more opportunities to feel the glorious history of the 4GT, company took the crankshaft from winning car 2016, shredded it into a powder and added this powder to the alloy, from which they were cut special plugs affixed to a dashboard on the passenger side. Technically, 4GT LM Edition hasn't undergone any changes and equipped with the same 3.5-liter V6 EcoBoost with 660 horsepower. In total, company will produce 20 such cars, and their price not yet announced. So, if you decided to become the owner of such a wonderful car, you should hurry up, as this is the last 4GT which the company will release in this generation. Mercedes-Benz has facelifted its A-Class and B-Class models, which are due to go on sale in the coming months. There are minor styling changes across the lineup, with a bulk of updates focused on technology and powertrains. Earlier this year, the brand unveiled the strategy to refocus its model lineup in high-profit luxury segments, dropping cheaper models. The brand said it plans to become a dedicated pure-play luxury car company and will target three segments – top-end luxury, core luxury and entry luxury. The petrol engines for both models now feature mild hybrid technology achieved via the fitment of a belt-driving starter generator and 48-volt battery. The revised engines are paired with 7 or 8-speed automatic transmissions. A 1.3-liter unit powers the A18 Neil, A2 Neil Neil and the same models in B-Class. The 18 Neil produces 136 horsepower, and the 200 produces 163 horsepower. An additional 14 horsepower is provided by the mild hybrid system as a part of a boost function. A more powerful 2-liter petrol engine is also offered in conjunction with all-wheel drive. It has power outputs of 190 or 224 horsepower. Mercedes has also equipped its A35 MG model with small hybrid technology, while the powertrain for the range topping A45 remains unchanged. The plug-in hybrid 2.5 nil E models get a larger battery as part of the update, extending their zero emission capability. The battery has a capacity of 15.6 kW, which provides a WLTP range of more than 40 miles for all versions. The battery can be charged more quickly too, as it now features 11 kW AC charging capability, as well as 22 kW DC charging. The A-Class was the first Mercedes model to feature the brand's MBUX infotainment system, and the updated A-Class and B-Class feature an updated version. Changes to the instrument cluster display provide a simplified layout, while the voice control system has been enhanced to explain and assist with vehicle functions. There is also a greater choice of paint now, including a new line of manufactured colors, both regular and metallic finishes. As previously, the Mercedes A-Class will continue to offer two body styles, hatchback and saloon, 
Together with updated color and trim combinations, the interior of a new A-Class and B-Class receive an updated steering wheel trim in Napa leather and additional USB-C port with high charging capacity. The new models will officially launch towards the end of the year. Well guys, that's all I have for today. I hope this video wasn't boring and you've enjoyed during watching. Subscribe to the channel to stay up to date with all automatic events. I wish you a good mood and see you soon. Bye.